these birds all behaved badly. In 2018, this was a life or death struggle between a hawk and a little Yorkie. The dog's owner realized what was happening and tried to shoo off the bird. No luck. So she grabbed a seat cushion. The hawk knew it had met his match and flew off. I was screaming like bloody murder. The Yorkie, Lulu, and her sister Heidi are just two pounds each. Owner Cecilia says the hawk ripped a deep hole in Lulu's neck. So we took her to the vet and they told us that luckily I got there in time. In 2012, this mom jumped into action to save the pet goose from a bald eagle. She told Inside Edition's Les Trent it happened as she was in the middle of breastfeeding her baby girl. You're yeah. topless outside in your underwear going to save your goose. Yeah, that is <laughs> sums it up right there. You can't make it up. You can't. I saw the massive eagle just swooping down right on our welcome mat, um, trying to grab her. Kate, carrying her baby on her chest, dashed out the door. Her scream scared off the giant bird of prey. Frankie the Goose got away unscathed. Not a scratch, not a feather, she's good. In 2020, it was a rough day for this reporter who had an unpleasant encounter with a bird before a live shot. Brett McLeod was reporting in Australia when a magpie swooped right into his eye. Kind of like Hitchcock's The Birds. Fortunately, he was able to shake it off and deliver his news like a professional. In 2017, this beachgoer wanted to feed a bird some chips, but she got a lot more than she bargained for. <laughs> one by one, seagulls swooped in. The petrified woman understandably fled as fast as she could. In 2015, this woman was minding her business when suddenly a pigeon attacked. Oh my God, it wouldn't leave me alone. I had to swing my bag all around me like this. Diane Daniels tried walking away, but the pigeon kept on. It was really bad. I think maybe she had a nest there. It looked like she was guarding something. Two others also had to duck for the bird. Oh, go away now, go away now, please go away now, please go away now. It started here, ended down there. So when that pigeon came after you, oh, there it is, there's the pigeon. There's a pigeon right there. Oh, I don't like this. It was the scariest thing in my life. Also from 2015, these wild turkeys went postal, quite literally. Every day. They chased the mailman as he made his appointed rounds. He says this happens every day, and he used a pole to keep the flock away. The peacock was on top of his head, like with like his talons, like flapping its wings. And when I went over to the peacock, it still didn't like get away from him. In 2016, this mom's two-year-old was attacked by a peacock while playing on the playground in Florida. The talons of the bird tore into the head, just missing the little boy's eye. Not now, booty. They're not nice. Not that booty. I think that having an animal around children's play equipment that has already attacked a child is unacceptable. For Inside Edition Digital, I'm Andreas Wendell.